very good morning class today we will read chapter number 15 of english grammar and we will learn about simple future tense earlier you have learned about simple present tense and simple past tense now it's simple future as you can see future future means the things that are going to be happen clear in future the things that are going to be happen so the rule of simple future tense is a simple future tense talks about an action that will happen in the future the action that will happen in the future we use shall or will plus the base form of the verb to form the simple future tense for example tom will throw the ball so what we put we put shall or will plus base form of the verb so with tom we put will and throw is the base form of the verb clear here are some examples simple future tense i will eat cake and when we will frame negative of this then we will say i will not eat cake and in interrogative we put will or shall before the subject so sentence will become will i eat cake and question mark second sentence is she will eat cake and in negative it will become she will not eat cake in interrogative it will become will she eat cake question mark clear they will eat cake negative they will not eat cake interrogative it will become will they eat cake question mark now these there are three tenses uh, as you already know first is simple present in which we use subject plus base form second is simple past in which we use subject plus past tense or second form of the verb third is simple future in which we use subject plus will shall plus base form of the verb first sentence is i cook in simple present we will say i cook in simple past it will become i cooked and in simple future it will become i will cook second is simple present you laugh in simple past laugh will become laughed you laughed and in simple future it will become you will laugh next he runs then in simple past it will became he ran and in simple future it will become he will run clear now look at these sentences the fill in the blanks with the simple future tense of the given verbs the bus dash come to pick you up at 8 am tomorrow we are talking about tomorrow we are talking about future so what we will use we will write the bus will come to pick you at 8 am tomorrow next is what means the sentence is interrogative in interrogative we put will shall before the subject so what we will come here what will you do if you lost your way clear what will you do next is the chief guest will arrive any at any any moment now next week i will visit the library akshit will return from his trip on thursday i will buy film tickets in the evening tomorrow she will leave this town tina will travel to mumbai next month so we are talking about future like here it is tomorrow here it is written uh, on thursday then in the evening then next month so we are talking about future next change the following sentences into the simple future tense so first read the sentence he woke up early in the morning as you can see walk walk is the past form of the verb so in future we use base form so it will become he will wake up in the morning it will become wake and we will add will he will wake up early in the morning second sentence is i wash the sunrise today this is also in simple past then it will become i will watch the sunrise today next cooking will give me pleasure we will write cooking will give me pleasure 
they will catch the ball the stool will break because of the heavy suitcase here it is broke but in simple future it will become break because we use base form animals will drink water from the stream he will sing a song for me i will buy a bag from the new shop in my neighborhood so these are the sentences that you have to do in your book thank you have a nice day